Hey everybody, welcome to, I think we're on episode, is it three or four of Pajamas and Coffee? I don't remember. You notice I'm not in my hoodie today. Like, that's pretty awesome accomplishment. Um, today we're going to do something fun and easy, really quick. Um, we are going to make a coffee soda. This is really fun and refreshing. It's a great thing to do in the event you have leftover coffee. Um, which I don't know many people that do, but sometimes you do. So, um, my tip is to keep a pitcher on hand that you can put in the fridge or a giant mason jar to put your leftover coffee in when you're done for the day. Just toss it in the fridge, like our coffee pot's right next to our fridge. Put it, put that in the fridge so then you can have more or less cold coffee, you know? Um, and then, um, what you're going to do with this recipe is you need... Club soda, sparkling water, tonic water, um, something to the like of that. Um, I use club soda. F get it in glass if you can. I couldn't find it in glass. And then simple syrup. Um, but you can make your own. I make mine at home. It's just um, one cup of water. One part water to one part sugar. Bring it to a boil. Not a hard boil. You don't want raw candy. Um, bring it to a boil until the sugar is dissolved and it's a little, as it chills, it'll start getting syrupy. But it's super easy, um, but gets sticky and messy, so watch out if you have kids and pets. Um, so all it is, is um, I made, what's in my pitcher is um, our Elefante from Twin Engine Coffee, because that's who I work with. Um, it's their Elefante. I really want to try this with Honeyberry, though, just because it's got a little bit um, of a playful characteristic. I think it would also be awesome with one of the black editions of either of these two. Um, I currently have Elefante Black, but um, Honey Bear Black is in route because these two are seasonal editions, whereas the regular medium roasts are year-round um, based on their availability and shipping. So let's get started. In my glass, I just have some ice cubes, and then I have one of my bamboo straws from my friends at Theranita. Use the link in my bio, get your own. Um, and I'm just going to pour a little bit of simple syrup into my glass over my ice. I have a sweet tooth, so I kind of like it a little bit sweeter. Um, and then you toss your coffee on it. Um, do about half, depending on how strong you like your coffee. And then you can stir that up to get that syrup. Um, Andrea, is this similar to your shakerado, or is it just sugar? Maybe yours is just sugar and iced coffee. That's next. But get that simple syrup stirred in, and then top it with your soda, your sparkling water. Um, so, that's it. I think this would really also, be, especially um, with the honey bear, it would be really good with maybe like a twist of orange. Um, I don't really think lemon would be good. Um, give it a shot. Let me know what you think. I think this is would be a great way to use um, coffee that you're not using after you've had your morning coffee and in Minnesota we just had our blizzard. You've been out there shoveling and now you want a cold drink but you don't want to waste your coffee or you want the caffeine, you want coffee but you don't want it hot. It's a great other way to use your coffee um, and save you a ton of money. Like all of these videos are supposed to save you a ton of money and fight poverty with the team um, from in Nicaragua. So give it a shot. Let me know what you think. Think, give me any tips you have um, and be sure to you know get your bamboo straws from Theranita um, and earrings from Theranita and whatever else I got on from them so all right you guys um, stay safe wear your mask please um, don't attend events stick to your household it's scary out there um, I know I'm scared so all right much love see you next time